Hello, my friends on YouTube. It's Arash Zapar, Bizarre, and I'm coming to you uh, on this, what today? what is today, Monday, from San Jose, California, I'm in my office. It's still getting set up. I moved into a new office. And this is one of the rooms that I kind of hang out in. And um, let's always remember that I'm your favorite bad boy on the web. That's for sure, right? Let's talk about something that I've observed. It's on my mind that I think uh, you probably have thought about yourself too. And you might want to get my perspective on it. It's the idea that if somebody doesn't like you, well, let me, let me put it like this. Let me, let me talk about myself, okay? I've always had this thing that I thought everybody had it. Honestly, I just thought everybody had it. But then I realized that people don't have this. So I'm going to tell you about it because it's actually more sane. It's better for you. And it's this thing that happens to me. If a person likes me, I like them. Simple, right? And if a person doesn't like me, I don't like them. And to the degree that they like me, I like them more. Because I assume, naturally, that they can see my good qualities and they can see who I am. And if they like me, that means they're going to treat me well. Right? When we like people, we treat them well. And when we don't like people, or even things, like if you don't like those shoes, you don't like that, that house or that car, you don't treat it well. It's just that when you like something, let's, let's say you like something, then you treat this thing really well. When you don't like something else, you don't treat it well. And so for me, it was always very simple. Let's say in regards to like men and women, like, like relationships. I was asked before, Arash, what kind of girls do you like? I said, well, I like girls that like me. Simple. The more the girl likes me, the more I like her. Now, of course, she has to be beautiful and all this stuff, but she could be the most beautiful creature on the goddamn planet. And if she's stupid and she can't see my value and she can't, she can't see my, my truth and my power and who I am, then why would I like her? Are you telling me that you, that you actually go chasing people that don't like you? And this is a disease that you women have, okay? And hopefully this video will help you a little bit. It's called self-respect. If a person likes you, they'll treat you well. If they don't like you, they won't treat you well. And so two things you can learn from that. Number one is if somebody's not treating you well, I don't care how much they say they like you, they don't. Because we instinctively, you don't have to try, right? You just, ew. You like those boots? <laughs> we instinctively, without effort, treat people and things that we like, we treat them well. Who's this? Sweet. And if somebody is saying they like you, the words, and you're not getting proper treatment, like they're not treating you well, you can rest assured 100% they don't like you, no matter what they say. So this is something that I always used, right? I mean, for me, it was instinctive. It may be because I met my old teacher, Manu, Manu Tupo, and he's the one that really showed me what true dignity and self-respect was. Also, my father, he was very good at that, too. So a combination of that was probably very important for me growing up. And if you have somebody, like, you're in a relationship, and suddenly they don't like you anymore, for whatever fucking reason, let them go, dude. Let them go. I'm talking to the guys, and I'm talking to the girls. I was talking to somebody the other day, and she was telling me that the guy that she didn't want to talk to anymore showed up at her work, flowers, showed up at her house, showed up. And I was like, what? Like, all I need to know is that that person doesn't like me. We're done. It's over. Like, how can I possibly create the feeling of liking somebody if they don't like me? Anytime a breakup has, has hurt my feelings for whatever reason, behind, behind that pain was this feeling. I thought, I thought, immaturely and incorrectly, I thought to myself, the person still loves me, but, and the truth of the matter is, the answer is no. When you love people, you treat them like you love them. Right? You don't leave people you love. This is a false idea. I still love you, but, mm, probably not, actually. Probably not. And so... 
I wanted to just go over that with you and give you my perspective because I think so many people are suffering. A lot of women are suffering for this because in your genetics, you're pushed to chase that thing that doesn't want you, right? And you have a lot of beautiful men that want to treat you well and you don't know how to take it even really, right? And I understand that. I, I truly understand the genetic reason for that. There is a way out of it, right? You keep following me, keep studying my stuff, keep understanding like what I teach because that's the code that I cracked, okay? Hold on. And since it's difficult for you as a woman to do this, you must first start by understanding that it's the right thing to do. And anytime you do the right thing, even though it's difficult, your life gets better. That's one of the lessons learned, right? It may be difficult to work out on some days. It may be difficult to do you know, your work or to even be kind to others. But if it's the right thing to do, the more right things you do, the more right things you do, guess what? The more you get uh, a better life. And the more wrong things you do, the more wrong things you do, the more you have a shitty life. You got what I'm saying? So please, take a moment for yourself or not. Just listen to me and admire my beard or looks or jewelry or tattoos or piercings or eyes or whatever it is you find attractive about me. And take a moment and ask yourself, since when did you lose so much self-respect that you thought you're supposed to like the people who don't like you? That's not okay. I'm here to tell you that the people who like you, they will treat you well. And the people who don't, they won't treat you well. So all you need to do is notice how people treat you and decide to have some self-respect and take it from here. Now listen, I have this daily coaching program. And there's a lot of people worldwide on this program and they're doing very well. It's called the Diamond Mind Program. You've probably heard of it if you've been watching me. It's $97 a month. It's a monthly subscription. I give you daily coaching. And on the weekends, one day a week, one day a weekend, I do a one-hour lecture where you get to ask me live questions. It's going gonna, it's gonna to change your life. You understand that? If these free videos are changing your life, believe me, my paid subscription will do a thousand times more. So all you do is you go to arajzapar.com and just sign up. What's the big deal, right? What do you got to lose besides your insanity? <laughs> As my teacher Manu Tupo told me, he said, be the best and fuck the rest. And that's what I've been doing. As I tell you every day, loyalty, loyalty is royalty. And remember, we are IMC Nation. See you in the next video. Share this.